Hi everyone, in this video we will cover Slide vs Notion, two powerful note taking tools. How do both differ? The video compares the topics shown on the screen right now. So without wasting our time, let's get started. Starting with platforms, both are available for Windows PC, Mac OS, iOS, Android and Web. The web version of both supports all the major browsers. While downloading Slide on Windows PC, the Windows Defender showed this warning. Well, this should not be a major issue, but the company should see this as a problem and fix it as soon as possible. Moving to the interface, Slide mobile app comes with a nice and sleek design. You get the home, new notifications and chat options. Slide uses channels and in each channel you find notes. The software is designed for teams and the premium plan of Slide also focuses on the teams. Notion contrarily comes with a nice and comfortable design. Both support the night mode on mobile but you won't find the tool under Notion settings on devices which offer the dark mode as the app uses the system's default in that case. On Notion mobile app you find the search, notifications, add new note, search and options buttons. The top left menu handles pretty much all the global settings. The desktop version of both have the same features but the design is somewhat different. Both do not offer the dark mode on desktop. So let's move to the next round. Both are block based services where you add new blocks as you go. Both can be used for complex pages as you would see on sites such as Wikipedia. Regarding the usage, Notion is more difficult to understand as it is a multi-level app. For example, adding a new page calendar shows you to create a note on each day and then you can add blocks in that page. Slide offers to mention users and comment on blocks but it does not offer to add notes to blocks. Both provide templates to give you some inspiration but Slide only offers 4 templates whereas Notion comes with over 60. That's huge. So what tools both offer? Both offer the basic tools such as headings, text editing, linking, image and file attaching of course embedding videos as well. Take a look at the full table comparing both. Overall, Notion offers more tools than Slide. Moving on, here we are close to finishing the video. Regarding sharing, there are not many surprises. Both offer to share notes with anyone via our link and you can add members to collaborate. Both offer to link access for the team members but you need one of the pad plans to unlock certain features. Both offer to export in PDF and Markdown sheet formats, but Notion also offers to export in HTML documents. Anyway, you might want to know some of the other features which make them stronger. Well, Slide offers to see the page history for free but very limited revisions. Notion does not offer to view in the free version. Also, you can ping a team member. Notion on the other hand offers to log pages and stop further edits for free. This feature is also available in Slide, but that one's in the paid version. The app offers to change the text style. And finally, the personal plan is free for students and educators. Both follow a different pricing model. The infographic is all you need to compare the pricing and plans. Here is the full table. Slide comes in two different types of plans, whereas Notion comes in three. The free version gives limited features. Slide's standard plan is made for teams as well as individuals, while Notion's personal plan is made for individuals and team plan is of course for teams. So which one is for you? The answer to this question can be found in the subscriptions. For startup teams, both are great and both offer unlimited team members to collaborate. A couple of elements where Slide beats Notion are total storage and integration. Looking at all the tools, you should try Slide first. But if you are a student or teacher, you must enjoy the personal plan of Notion. Anyway, thanks a lot for watching. I hope the video helped. Please like it if it helped. And of course, subscribe to my channel for more comparison videos. Bye bye.